What is up, guys? Beaky Forty Nine here. We are back on the Desolation map, and I know I promised that there would be no more mall videos until three hundred. Uh, okay, I gotta do it, guys. I got one more video for you. One more, please. I'm sorry. Ah, psych again. I got you twice in a row. Two weeks in a row. I got you guys. We're not working on the mall. The mall's done. Right? The mall is done, done, done. As done, as done, as it's gonna get. Right now, we're working on the mall's little companion here. The, what do you call it? The parking garage. And I have worked a lot off camera for you guys. Oh, man. It is getting close to ready. You know, this parking garage might be ready for 300. Although, you know, there's a little bit of a problem there. I've been working on videos, guys. I'm going to try to do my best to bring you a really cool 300 video. I don't know if you guys are going to like it or not, but we'll see. We'll see. Um, I want to get this done so I can put this in my 300 mall video. Not the episode 300, but I'm going to make another video for the mall. And uh, I'm going to try to, you know, I don't, I'm not going to say the word viral, but I'm trying to get a lot of views on it because, you know, a lot of people are working on malls. You got Minecraft Builder 92, who's now Safety Boost. You know, I've tweeted to him that I'm doing a mall and he hasn't really responded, so he doesn't care. I don't want to say my mall's better or anything than anyone else's mall, but I love this thing. We spent nine months working on it. This thing doesn't work. I can't take the juice. Uh, we spent a lot of time working on it, so I want to make one of those like cinematic videos that shows off the mall in like three minutes or less. You know what I'm talking about? So when that comes out, guys, I would really hope that you help me spread that video as much as possible. You know, a lot of people are doing malls, and I want to show them my mall because it's pretty fantastic. Pretty fantastic. All right, so what are we doing in here? Let's go out and look around. We filled out all four of these stairwells. They're all identical, block for block, or at least I hope so. There was one issue, okay, so I didn't have a lot of space, so I couldn't really, you know, do it uh, in the way I originally wanted to, but this is how we're doing the, the stairwells here. Now, there is one problem is when you get to this floor, it doesn't, it's not natural, you gotta, like, go over here, so I think I should take that out. So, yeah, it's a little weird, and that's just because of the space issue. Oh, I hated that I had to do this, which... And I don't know why I'm pointing out my flaws to you, but, you know, you guys are getting the real deal flaws and all. Flaws and all? <laughs> it's like shock and all, but with flaws. But that's the only floor that happens on, so it's not such a huge deal. It does happen in every in every floor, in every um, stairwell, but uh, I'm going to just live with it. Does this look fake to you? I think it's like unsupported. I don't know. It feels alright to me. I kind of like it. So yeah, we got four stairwells here, all of them identical. Let's hope. Let's hope. And they're going to have a nice view of the city. Oh, look at the view from out here, right? I'm sure you can like hop on a car and eventually get on top of here so you could even commit suicide if you want or who knows what you want to do. But look at the view up here. Who's this? What is this? No. Oh, oh. See, that's what I don't like. What is he doing? Okay, so you went over and you hit a dispenser and you gave me the thing that you did and then you expect me to to not be upset. Okay. Yeah, there's dispensers here. You can trigger stuff that you're not supposed to. That's a, the price I pay for giving you guys free reign around here. All right, so what I'm going to do is I got to put a lot of cars, obviously. Obviously, I got to put a lot of cars in here. Let's go down. Look at the parking spaces. I got a lot of parking spaces here. I'm gonna fill it full of cars. It's not gonna be packed, jam packed like there's the, like the apocalypse hasn't happened. So I'm not gonna do that. But uh, I'm gonna put a, a bunch of cars here. Like people had to abandon them because they died. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They they left their cars because they're dead. And yeah. So I I did an okay job here. I think. What do you guys think? I like it. It feels like a real parking structure. I'm about to kick both of these guys for following me around while I'm trying to record. How annoying, you know? I give you guys the luxury of looking around this map, and all you want to do is get in my videos? Like, what kind of mentality is that? You know? Come on. So, yes, uh, I'm also going to put, like, uh, in these blank spots here, I'd probably, like, ticket stuff. You know, you have to buy your tickets. You got to validate your parking. And, um, so I'll probably pay a, a, a thing here. You know what, I'm going to go through every floor and get rid of those, because it's all on this floor. So let's get rid of all of these. Because they're preventing... Yeah, that one's good. They're preventing some... Uh, that one's okay. Some natural flow. We got to have the natural flow. Did you guys like yesterday's uh, question of the week video? I had a lot of fun making that. Uh, I had an important message that I had to get across, and uh hope you guys 
didn't take offense. I don't know why you would take offense, but I hope you guys understood what I was trying to say because it was very important to me. So what else could I add in this place? You know, like t more ticket stuffs here on every on every floor. I'm gonna put a ticket vending machine thing here. Uh, let's go outside here and uh, let's uh, show you some of my plans. So before we we show any plans, what we need is to get on the other juice, and we're also gonna need some nether rack. Not nether rack. What's it called? Endstone. Yes, we need the endstone. Then we'll need some bedrock. Okay. So I'm probably going to make these sidewalks here. Let's get on the juice. Juice number two. Probably going to make these about four wide. And uh, in case you guys aren't aware, in case you didn't know, this will be the nightlife, downtown nightlife area of the city. So it's sort of downtown, but it's really all by itself. We're going to have all sorts of nightclubs and bars and bowling alleys and movie theaters. And oh man, we're going to have a lot of stuff over here. So, we have to have a parking garage because, you know, this parking garage doesn't just service the mall. It also services some of these nightlife type areas. You know the nightlife. It's time to boogie. You know what I'm talking about. People got to get their dance on. Get their dance on. Okay. So, here we go. Metal ball, please. I'm trying to record. Okay, I said your name. Are you happy? Is th that's what you want, isn't it? You want me to say your name on camera. You have said it. You know you didn't help. Usually I save, you know, the shout outs to people who help out on the map. Like Zachary83 and Sage Omnivore 500 who just helped me film for a little bit for episode 300. Yeah, a little bit. Oh, it's going to be cool, guys. Now, how wide should this be? I think maybe just too wide on this one because this is more like an alley. So I'm going to make a road come down here. And this is going to be like an alley. So this won't be as wide. Probably five wide. Right? Five wide? Something like that? That seems right. So right here, that will be a movie theater, guys. A big one. A big one. I don't know how many floors it's going to be, but it's going to be big. I don't know when we're going to start that. I don't know. I'm just trying to get episode 300 done for you guys. It's a grind out here. I'm trying to make multiple videos, and I'm trying to make them funny and interesting. So... You know, my focus right now is not 100% on building, so I apologize for that. But, you know, once we get 300 out of the way, I'm going to go on a building tear. We're going to start the community server. Oh, man, I'm looking forward to that. I can't believe that I think it was the first time, right? This is the first time that any Minecraft update on the consoles has failed certification testing. I didn't know. it would. I couldn't think it would be possible. They've always passed, as far as I can remember. I don't think they've ever failed. Have they? So this is unprecedented. I don't know when the update's going to drop now because, you know, they have to fix what they didn't have working. Basically, what certification testing means is, you know, they made their update, they did what they wanted to do, and they submitted it to Minecraft, Minecraft, to Microsoft, and Microsoft makes sure that that update doesn't conflict with their operating system in any way, basically. So it wasn't any problem on the 4J side. It was more of a problem with the Microsoft side. So hopefully, hopefully this gives them a little bit of time to... Added an addition that I think is very important. I tried to contact 4J Steve, but I got ignored. I don't know. I don't have enough clout in the Minecraft community to, to garner his attention every time I tweet him. But we're having a severe issue. People's chunks are not loading into my world. They just can't load them. They say, oh my goodness, Bean, your chunks aren't loading. I'm out of here. And that is because of my Sea of Glowstone. This is under the entire map. And look at the animation. If you're trying to tell me that doesn't cause lag... I got a bone to pick with you. How does that not cause lag? Right? That's a, that's a lag fest just waiting to happen. It's not even waiting. It's happening. So, 4J, I beg you. We need a toggle button for the animation. The, the animation is causing f chunk loading problems. Chunk loading problems. People can't load their chunks because it takes so long to load because of the, all the animations. It's my theory anyway. What do I really know about programming? Nothing. Okay? So, that's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking. I don't know for sure. But uh, it needs to be investigated because I people can't load chunks in my world. It doesn't make any sense. I don't know why. They, they come in and just nothing will load. And it'll load, but it'll take like a few minutes per chunk. And that is just not okay. That is not okay. And uh, it needs to be fixed in my humble opinion. I hope it doesn't continue past TU32, because if it does, we're going to be stuck like this, and I don't know if PvP is going to be possible. Maybe if we we're, like, restricted to one chunk or two. So, that'll be a movie theater. Booyah shaka. And then this, 
Okay, well, we'll extend the road out here. I'm just putting these as placeholders. We're going to put a lot of detail into these roads as we always do. Actually, that's wrong because I didn't put in my sidewalk, my gutter. See, that's wrong. I didn't put in the gutters. So, let's just put that like that so I remember. So this has to come out one more. This whole thing can go. That's got to be gutter. Wait, I think they both can go. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, and then gutter. That's not right. Gutter goes this way. Gutter goes that way. It's not gutter, but you know what I'm talking about. You know the, the, the difference between sidewalk and street. You know, there's a little curb, right? Is that five? One, two, three, four, five. So that's how it's going to be. And then this will come out like that. Okay? Now you're probably wondering what's going to go here. Well, that's a great question. And I'll be happy to answer it, guys, right now, today. Have I, have I told you guys this? But in that little space right here, let me just... Okay, I'm all over the place. We're going to have a gas station. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Now, this is not going to be just any normal gas station, guys. This is going to be a crazy one. Because, now I'm still you know, on the fence about this. I'm, I'm not really sure how I'm going to do it. But I want this gas station to be exploded and on fire. You know what I'm talking about? Exploded and on fire. I mean, this is the apocalypse. You know what I'm saying, guys? This is the apocalypse. It's got to be exploded and on fire. We have one gas station that's in perfect condition. And you know what? That doesn't make sense because the apocalypse comes and people want the gas. I keep putting this the wrong way. <laughs> people want gas. You know what I'm saying? They need the gas. They want to get out of town. They got to load up on gas. Metal bowl. Seriously. This is your last warning. This is your warning. Do not get in my way. Please. I'm trying to build. I'm trying to concentrate on what I'm talking about. It's hard enough to talk and build at the same time. You add a, a person throwing off your concentration and it becomes a real issue for me. Okay? I'm going to start talking about nonsense and start building junk. Okay? So please, guys, the game is open. Yes, you have the freedom to move about the map as much as you want. I realize that the chunks aren't loading right now. That's not my fault. Okay? So... Don't just hover around me while I'm trying to build or trying to record. It's not good. It's not good. So this is going to come across here. I know that uh, we have a lot of blockiness. And this is a, a common complaint from myself. The city is very laid out in a very blocky square manner. As you see here. And I realize that, guys. But the only reason I'm doing it is because I want this to be the biggest project on consoles you have ever seen. And in order for that to happen, I have to fit, at, fit the most possible buildings and interiors that I possibly can and in order to do that I'm gonna have to do it in a grid like fashion you know a lot of people are saying oh uh, you know it's it's kinda of boring when you you lay out cities in grid like fashion and I agree it is boring but we have a goal here we're trying to accomplish something I'm trying to make the coolest biggest game you've ever seen I'm not trying to build an aesthetic city that's just a byproduct of what we're doing I'm trying to build desolation a game mode that's never been seen before on console as far as I can tell there's been stuff like it but nothing like this a whole city where we have fit as many buildings as we possibly can and every single building has an explorable interior every single interior has loot that you can scavenge and use for your PvP adventures as you go through the city trying to survive while other people and other monsters and starvation tries to kill you have you seen anything like that on consoles guys why do I only have 2,000 subscribers okay why I don't understand. This is groundbreaking stuff in my little pea brain. Okay? In my little pea brain, I feel like this is crazy. So, you know, I'm, I'm looking for more, more views, more subs, of course. Just because I'm doing something that's not really not really seen in this community. You point me to someone who's working on a project of this size and scale that's not just esoteric. You know, that's, that's going to have a function when it's done. So that's why I feel like this is a, a very unique project. And this is where we're going to run into some problems. We'll just change that. Okay. So I'm just working on um, planning, really, today. Planning, planning, planning. I'm not going to go into fine details. I'll probably do the fine details of the parking structure off camera because I, I built some cars for you guys the other day. I'm sure you don't want to see more cars. It's more of the same, you know. So, uh, yeah. And uh, I'll work on this gas station on camera. I want you guys to see how this turns out because this is going to be crazy. A gas station on fire? There's going to be a car wash. Um, this is a rather large lot for a gas station. Let's look at my other gas station. That's a large place, so I may have to do some other thing as well. So this one, 
I mean, this feels like a good size, right? It feels like that's how a gas station should be, this size. Uh, but there's going to be a car wash on this one, so maybe even a car repair. So maybe that's why this one's so large. There you go. They got the idea. Thank you guys for standing behind out of the camera. There you go. They got the idea. So maybe, yeah. So maybe this will be like a car repair and gas station. Who knows? We'll see. We'll do it all on camera, and then you guys will see what it is. So if you guys have any ideas what I can, you know, attach to this gas station, I'm all ears. This is going to be crazy. Two more days till episode 300, guys. I'm excited. I hope you're excited. 300 episodes, who would have ever thought? Who would have ever thought? So I want to thank you guys for liking, for sharing, and for subscribing, I and for leaving comments. Oh, it means so much to me. I really do appreciate it. I hope you guys are enjoying the series as much as I am. Stay tuned for episode 300. Happy Minecrafting. Peace.